guys today i'm going to show how to deploy laravel application to cpanel uh, this is my uh, website you can see this is a uh, run on uh, local server uh, now i am going to stop the local server and uh, i am going to uh, build my uh, application using npm run build Uh, building is uh, completed uh, then I move into my project file and uh, ship it compress it to ship file Uh, I'm going to uh, rename it as project now I want to upload my project file to uh, my C panel so I am going to a uh, file manager and uh, then uh, I create new folder I name this folder as uh, CRT crew I create uh, this folder uh, outside in uh, domain or subdomain uh, this uh, file in the uh, root directory uh, now I am moving into it and upload my uh, ship file it is uploading file is uh, successfully uploaded uh, now I am going back I want to extract uh, this file The, then I uh, delete this uh, file and also I want to uh, delete uh, some files in public folder uh, before that uh, I want to move uh, these folders to my uh, domain uh, which, uh, which we are going to uh, deploy our uh, project so uh, I am going to uh, deploy my project to the crew.com uh, this uh, domain so I am moving uh, my public uh, folder content to it in here uh, I select all the files and uh, make copy for my uh, domain uh, you can see uh, there is a uh, file now I'm going on to uh, CRT crew folder again and uh, delete uh, files other than the uh, build file manifest in here I delete 
that's it then I am going to back and delete all other files now I am going into my uh, actual domain and in here I want to delete this manifest JSON now I want to uh, edit my uh, ENE in here uh, we can set uh, our app name and uh, debug also I'm going to set as false uh, in here I set uh, my domain as app URL And uh, my ENU type set as production. And also, uh, I am going to uh, set my uh, database ENU variables. For that, uh, I am going to. Uh, database in here I create a new database uh, I create a database as um, and also I give the username I copy uh, this database database name and uh, then paste it to my env and also also create a username uh, then generate password. then you all the privileges and uh, complete uh, database creation and also I'm going to uh, save my ENU file now I'm going to my uh, PHP my admin and also uh, you can see my database and uh, I need to uh, import my uh, local database this is my uh, local database I am going to uh, export it and then uh, select my uh, newly created database and import database 
then uh, you can choose the file and click import you can see our uh, database uh, is uh, imported now close the tab and uh, go again to uh, domain in the uh, domain you need to add uh, this index.php also in here uh, I am going to edit it you need to uh, edit this uh, path it uh, adding a folder name I add uh, CRT uh, crew for this and also paste for uh, these positions too then save it uh, now we can uh, load the domain you can see uh, our web page is uh, now loading uh, but you can see uh, our images are not working uh, because uh, we are not uh, storage php storage link there uh, for that uh, we need to go to cpanel and actually uh, in the cpanel uh, we need to go for go uh, terminal in terminal uh, we need to uh, move our file cd uh, crt crew in here uh, we need to uh, run this code after home uh, we need to give our file name crt crew Slash, slash slash public After uh, refreshing this, you can see a uh, storage uh, link there. When we refresh the our page, you can see our images are loading. Thanks for watching.